Greetings, this is Shay Jackson with Hype Math. In today's fifth grade math test prep video, we will be discussing comparing decimal values. Let's get started. Our first problem states, which number comes between 3.72 and 4.13? Or we can say, which number comes between 3 and 72 hundredths and 4 and 13 hundredths. When solving a problem, the first thing we must do is find out what we are looking for. For this problem, it's pretty easy. We are looking for a number that comes between 3.72 and 4.13. That means the number must be more than 3.72 and less than 4.13. Again, we are looking for a number that is more than 3.72 and less than 4.13. The steps to solve this problem are the following. Number one, we are going to cross out the answers that are less than 3.72 because remember we said if it's in between that we need numbers that are more than 3.72 and also we want to cross out numbers that are more than 4.13 because if it's in between 3 and 72 hundredths and 4 and 13 hundredths anything over 4 and 13 hundredths would be would not be in that range and finally, we are going to circle the answer. So looking at our answer choices, we have A, 4.32. Is that, that is more than 3.72. However, it's also more than 4.13. So we know that we can cross that answer out. B, 3.48. Well, that's less than 3.72, and we need it to be more than 3.72. So we can cross answer choice B out. C, okay, it's more than 3.72. However, it is less than 4.13. So that potentially is an answer choice. And D is 2.89. Well, that is less than 3.72. So we know that we can cross out answer choices A, 4.32, because it is more than 4.13. We can cross out B, because it is less than 3.72. And we can cross out D, because it is less than 2.89. I'm sorry, we can cross out 2.89, because it is less than 3.72. We're left with C, 4.05, and that is our answer. Let's try another problem. Our problem states, Ms. Williams was working with a small group of students on comparing decimals. She asked the students to write down a number between 9.054 and 9.183 or we can say 9 and 54 thousandths and 9.183 thousandths. Carla wrote 9.201, Tom wrote 9.197, Angie wrote 9.024, and Gary wrote 9.095. Who wrote the number correctly? A is Carla, B is Tom, C is Angie, D is Gary. In order to solve this problem, we must find out what we are looking for. Okay, we are looking for which student wrote a number that is in between 9.054 and 9.183. The steps to solve the problem are the following. Number one, we will cross out the answers that are less than 9.054 
and that are more than 9.183. And number two, after that we will circle our answer. So let's look at what, in, what numbers each student wrote. Carla wrote 9.201, okay? And we must look to see if that's in between 9.054 and 9.183. If it's not, Carla is out. Tom wrote 9.197. Again, we must see if it's 9.97 is greater than 9.054, but less than 9.183. Angie wrote 9.024. Is 9.024 greater than 9.054 and less than 9.183? And lastly, Gary wrote 9.095. Is Gary's number in between 9.054 and 9.183? Let's take a look. Okay, so for Carla, we see that she was too high. Her answer is 9.201. Well, 9.201 is greater than 9.183, so we can mark that answer choice out. Tom's answer, B, is 9.197. Well, that's greater than 9.183 as well, so Tom is out of here too. C, Angie's, is 9.024. Well, 9.024 is actually less than 9.054. The answer choice that's left is D, Gary, 9.095. So we will circle our answer choice D, Gary, whose answer choice is 9.095. This is Shay Jackson with Hype Math and in today's lesson we went over fifth grade math test prep comparing decimal values. Talk to you soon.